Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, let's talk about renewable and non-renewable resources. A natural resource is a natural material that is used by humans. Examples include water, oil, wood from trees, and coal. Many of these resources are changed into products that make our life more comfortable or convenient. Natural resources can be classified as renewable or non-renewable. A renewable resource can be replaced at the same rate in which the resource is used. Common renewable resources used to produce energy include solar, like the solar panels converting solar energy into electricity, wind, which can turn turbines to produce electricity, hydroelectric, which involves moving water turning a turbine, geothermal, which involves capturing the underground steam that flows to a turbine and then produces electricity, and biomass, which involves plants and poop being burned to produce electricity. Air and water are renewable natural resources also. They don't regrow like trees, but they are always being renewed. They move in cycles. Remember, renewable resources can regrow or be replaced within a person's lifespan. Non-renewable resource is a resource that forms at a rate that is much slower than the rate that it is formed. Coal is an example. It takes millions of years to create coal, and once it is used up, it is no longer available. You can use the phrase con to remember three popular non-renewable resources. This stands for coal, oil, natural gas. Nuclear fuel is also a non-renewable resource. Uranium-235, which is used in nuclear power plants, is found in a finite amount. Minerals used for making metals are also non-renewable. For example, steel, which is used in making buildings, is made of iron ore. Iron ore is mined from the earth and is limited resource. Non-renewable res natural resources are things that take longer than a person's lifespan span to be replaced. In fact, it takes millions of years to form these. Because many important resources are limited, we can all reduce, reuse, and recycle. You can turn off lights when you're not in a room. You can ride your bike more and walk more to reduce the amount of gasoline used. You can reuse and recycle things like plastic jugs, jars, paper, paper bags, plastics, cardboard, aluminum, and even steel. If you'd like to know more about how we get energy from non-renewable resources, this playlist will help. Thanks for watching, and Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.